lot of England's up for nine quid. It's coming home. Fucking big boy. <laughs> Is that the dance I do when I get a free piece of chips and chips? It's like Chloe at Beat Projects, which was 13. <laughs> well, miss, I guess I'll be on my way now. You just give me a... Hello, everyone. We've arrived in Bangkok now. We just um, dropped our stuff off at our hotel. Um, I filmed a little clip of what it looked like and now we've come down to the Grand Palace. We paid 500 baht to get in, which is about 12 pounds each. Jamie's got his ten of pants, it's to run. On our second day in Bangkok, we decided to visit some of the malls. The first one we went to was called Terminal 21. Each floor of the mall has a different theme. It's got airport style signage which shows you which country you're going into as you're going up each escalator towards a new floor. I spent about an hour walking around all the different floors and looking at the theming. The Japanese one was one of my favourites, but we also liked the London themed floor. This had a toilet which was themed like the London Underground and also had a London Red Bus. On the top floor there's a canteen style food hall which has various different stalls all serving cheap food. We had to buy a preloaded card in order to pay for our food. We decided to try the mango sticky rice for the first time. Unfortunately we weren't massive fans, I think we'll stick to the pancake roti. Next stop on our tour was MBK which is known for being able to find all of your cheap knockoff stuff. We had a little mooch around all of the shops. I was on the hunt for a new phone case and some sunglasses. Didn't actually end up getting either of those items but I did get a England top which was perfect. I got an England top for nine quid. It's coming home. What a day. Hi, I'm TV. Welcome to the Mario Sounds. Come in, I'll show you this. Here we have the bedroom, two single beds. There's far too about to have two people in bed. Our desk where you can do all important business meetings. Up to your phone, all the room service. We've finally got a separate sink, shower, and toilet. So Chloe can have a shower whilst I'm having a poo. Oh, hello. You're a strong man like me. After you relax all day shopping around Bangkok, you come to our built in gym. As you can see, we're fully equipped with our bed meals, and our bench presses, more bench presses. And do you know what about this is? So if you're like me and you don't want to go to the gym but you want to go for a swim, follow me, I'll show you. Oh, in the city centre of Bangkok, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for joining us, MTV. So we just went swimming and then we came back to the room, just got changed and then we're about to go out to Khao San Road, which is the most popular walking street in Bangkok where all the tourists stay and, and tend to get together. We are quite close to it but we're not actually on Khao San Road which is good because it's going to be quite loud and if you go there you're probably not going to get any sleep. So yeah we'll show you what that looks like when we get there. <laughs>
It's like Chloe at Beat Projects when she was 13. <laughs> Got one arm. We need to get a massage, but then uh, people start coming street dance in front of me. This is the dance I do when I get a three piece chicken and chips. Good evening, vlog. Slash mum, slash dad. We're on our way home. We've we went to a few bars, which was good. We've seen some music, which is always good. We went to this art oh, weird bar, we went to this bar, it was like this band who were obviously tied. Didn't have a word. Didn't have a clue what they were saying. Didn't have a word. Didn't have a word. Actual Road. I weren't a fan. Literally, they're in like four to them. Yeah. Hassle. They literally stand straight where you're standing, and you have to walk past them. It's like either side. It's like an archway of people going. But I'm gonna get my friend. But I'm gonna get my friend. And they touch you as well. Like they actually physically Grab touch you. you. It's a bit. Not a fan of that. So we went the street along, which is where we got stuck in the rain to start with. And that was much calmer, yeah, nicer bars, a bit Antle more bars, chill. You sit down, relax, they weren't yeah, hassling people you. People were playing guitar and stuff, that was nice. Yeah, so if you're going to Khao San Road, great, but don't go to Khao San Road, go to the street next to it. <laughs> if, you're, if you're like us and you're boring now. But we're going to bed now, so we'll see Goodbye, you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Hello everyone, we're on day three now in Bangkok. We've just got up and had breakfast in our hotel. And now we're gonna go and get a taxi, hopefully to two more of the temples that we didn't see the other day, called Wat Arun and Wat Pho. First temple we've come to is called Wat Arun. A bit cheaper than the other one to get in this one. I think it's because it's not as grand. However, looking at it, it does look quite nice. Um, this one you can actually go up some of the like temple structures and go like halfway up, which is quite cool. Just bought these 
croissants. Basically a croissant cross river waffle. Got an almond chocolate one and a Nutella banana. Jamie's insisting he doesn't want one, but I think he'll end up with one in a minute. Yeah, there we go. Uh, that was nice and it's not sweet. Mine was the banana. A bit of a tiring day today, so both had a nap. Um, decided we're not going to go out for food tonight. We've just ordered a grab, so we're getting McDonald's to the hotel. Come down, kids. Chicken. 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 One yours, she double cheese for <laughs> Nuggets. Oh, mine was a quarter pound. I didn't actually know what I was ordering. The app's all in Thai, so we just had to guess but by the pictures wait, what we were ordering. Wait, 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 wait. Look at the size of this coat. I don't know why it's so big. Fucking big boy. <laughs> Day four in Bangkok today, it's our last day. We're flying to Chiang Mai tonight. I'm just about to go and check out of our hotel because we've got a 12 o'clock check out. Then we're going to go find some lunch. And then we're going to go hiking up a hill. We're going up to the Golden Mount, which is essentially a Buddha on top of a hill. Uh, we're going to hike up the top of there and then we get to see like all of Bangkok as well, which will be quite nice. <laughs> We just had breakfast at a little cafe called Petit Paytan or something like that. I don't know. I'll, <laughs> I'll find, find the out. Name. Yeah. <laughs> um, it was nice. We had a had a bacon, basically BLT cheese toasty, but it was really nice. Chloe had an American breakfast, which is like a poor man's full English. It's really weird. <laughs> Fried egg, two sausages, and some bacon. And my and bread was actually not very good toast. sorry. My bread was actually toasted, whereas Chloe's wasn't, which is really weird because Chloe actually had toast. Odd. But now we're about to go up to this building here behind us. Um, we'll flip the camera over in a minute. That's called the Golden Mount. <laughs> Lots of steps. <laughs> Now, so we're coming from the pool. We've just gone downstairs to the bar slash restaurant. We're finally redeeming our free complimentary drink that we got when we checked in. We're not sure what we're getting, a bit of a mystery drink, but we'll see. I was just saying, the staff here, like, within about 10 seconds of seeing you, they're like, run after you, get your bags, like, put an umbrella over your head because it's now raining. Can't do, any, can't do anything more for you, can they? Like, so nice. Very nice hotel, we've enjoyed this hotel. VIP treatment. <laughs> Got chilli in it. It's a frozen spring onion. Spring onion. I don't actually know what it is. <laughs> it tastes like limey, like really weak lemonade. Is that good or bad? It's nice. We're ending our Bangkok vlog here and we're now in Chiang Mai. We had a pretty disastrous start to our first night in Chiang Mai, so you'll see that in the next video. Thanks for watching. See you next week. Bye. Well, miss, I guess I'll be on my way now.